So this is what happens after a night full of dipping and reversed, reverse dipping and florals and swirlies and all kinds of stuff. So have this pineapple <laughs> and I've done, I, I, I've placed dots and I've drawn flowers and I've drawn all kinds of stuff and I just kind of wanted to see what would happen with this pineapple. I've had this pineapple for, I, don't even, I can't even tell you how long and how many times I've done stuff over it and under it and through it. But we'll see. I mean, there's there's people that would be that are rolling their eyes right now, saying he's working on that stupid pineapple again. <laughs> but this is kind of one of those things. It's someone. It's something that I pull out whenever I'm kind of mulling over stuff, or you know, it's something that's always there, and I always paint over it. I'm never quite satisfied, but I think that that's the whole point of this pineapple. So. Anyhow, well, let's see what happens. I got all kinds of colors going on. Oh, you know what I wanted to do? Oh, crap. Did I save enough? Yes, yes. I always have plenty of yellow. I don't have any white, but that's okay. Come here. Yellow. I do have a couple of things to post uh, from the night. So, uh... I did some of um, Cheeto Designs little artsy blocks. I got, I did uh, reverse dip florals on them with these guys. Look, I'll show you just real quick. I know we're doing something else, but I just got a cookie cutter taped paper towel dip. Oh, reverse dip. Another one, reverse dip. And then I stopped taping and I just got a rubber band and just was rubber banding them and Dipping. I mean, it, I've taken the process down from making my little tool from, gosh, it took me, well, I had to plan it first, so that took time, a toe, 30 seconds, if that long. Okay, so let me make sure. Liner. I mean, it's almost dry. It's, it's making a beautiful skin, but I, I've, I've got other things I want to do with this, so I need to get this done. So, I'm not going to be able to feel very well, but you know what? Let me go ahead and wet it just. It's. Well, now it's even more waterproof. I'm not going to be able to tell if. I've caught all the bubbles out, but we'll just, like Fiona says, like playing with paint with my hands like a kid. So, good. I wasn't quite ready, but sometimes I'm just not ready. What do y'all think this is gonna do? I'm not, I'm not, in a I'm not trying to make a floral, so, you know, this is what's called a reverse floral dip, or reverse dip floral, only because at the end that's what Fiona was making, but um, just the technique itself, it, it creates, I mean, like I said in the other video, it blends the paint in such a way that you just cannot do with your hands, and, you know, if you've got the right formula going, you got magic. All right, crap. What did I forget again? This is the fourth time I've said this. Well, for me tonight, I don't know if you'll see a whole video at the same time, but I don't know where I'm gonna put the pineapple, or the, the thing when I pull it off, so. 
always know where you're going to put the uh, wet paint. I always want to show it to y'all, and then I end up dripping on other stuff, and I get mad. Okay, ready? I'm going to try to go straight up, although my straights up have been <laughs> kind of wonky. Please make it pretty pineapple. Look at that. Look at that. Oh my goodness. I, oh. Yay. This is what I was waiting for all damn night. My gosh, why couldn't I have just done this in the beginning? Lord, I always feel like I'm waiting for some, some specific something to come up and you know what I think for today or for last night this is it that's gorgeous I'm just absolutely gorgeous because I can see I can I, I can see the future I already know we're gonna get some fantastic cells I've got this beautiful pineapple skin over here I don't even know I don't even know how to describe it right now What a freaking gorgeous hole that is. See, the technique. It's not a floral, but the technique. My gosh. This is going to be exciting. I don't even, I'm not even going to care how many times it takes me to turn this stupid thing on. this all natural. How about that? How do you like them apples? <laughs> oh my gosh. All these colors popping up. See? I love magic. Can y'all believe that? I don't know if I've mentioned it before. <laughs> Until the age of, I don't know, probably eight or nine, I would not talk to people, like almost at all. I was, and I am still an extreme introvert, it's just, when I talk about art, I can't help myself. I mean, these flappers just start, I start just flapping away and, you know, I, I can weave any conversation into art. I promise you that because that's all I really want to talk about. And so I've got, a, I've found a way. I learned that from my mom. Not about art. I mean, I learned a lot about art from my mother, but she has her way of going right back to stuck, which I do all the time. Really love it. I'm gonna show you the the pull part one more time because because it's drying so naturally on that uh, shower curtain liner. And you know, I wonder because I don't remember if it was Fiona or it wasn't. It was somebody else that showed a skin and said, "This is what I what maybe it was Fiona." Anyhow, uh, from one of the the pulls, you know, the paint that comes off. And uh, I know that there are also some people who, that is what they do, they do, they, they work for the skin. Um, because I can now turn that, I'm gonna let the, oh. I said I was gonna show you and I didn't. So I don't wanna touch the pineapple, but let's see, can you see that? Look how pretty that is. I mean, all of it, all of it together. There's so many gorgeous pieces in there for jewelry. I mean, that's that's heaven, heaven right there. If anybody has advice for me on product, perhaps um, quality, um, because I know, I mean, it's one thing to make 
make jewelry. I, I've been making jewelry since I was, you know, a kid. But, you know, I'm not, I don't, I'm not trying to make a macaroni necklace anymore. You know, I want to, I want to know what would you wear is really, I guess, the question. Because I can make something pretty. I make something gorgeous. I, I really can't I mean, obviously. <laughs> I didn't do that. But anyway, and I have, but it's not something I think somebody would wear often. You know, maybe it's just a, uh, some bling for a special night. But anyway, I got questions about jewelry. I don't, I wear a lot of it. I make, I'm making a lot of beaded jewelry. I'm actually known for, before I started doing this, for my glass bead bracelets because I make them uh, really, really long and really, really colorful. Um, but anyhow, where was I? How did I get there from this? Pineapple. Yeah, you know what? I don't think I'm going to have to do the pineapple again. So all you people who were rolling your eyes at me whenever I said I'm pulling out this stupid pineapple again, y'all can just relax because I think we're done. And I'm done. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna just, you know, go with this. Uh, I got a suggestion and please forgive me I, I had your name at the tip of my tongue uh, somebody who uh, referred me to a specific place or specific type of resin uh, I'm gonna post this video today hopefully right now uh, if anybody else has any advice uh, I would love to I've got literally a gold mine worth of art in my apartment no, not in my apartment. It's way over on the other side of town. It's some place I don't even know. I don't know the number of the storage. Anyway, but th the point is, it's either unfinished or varnished or highly glossed. Uh, there's about 2% of my work that's been resin. Um, but I, I do know that the value, wh where the value lies there. And so... Um, I'm going to, I, I, so I'm gonna need probably uh, a lot of it, and then I'm just gonna start going to work and, and resonating everything, um, because I do have some, some festivals and some shows and I've, I've gotta I've got pay rent. Um, so uh, if anybody has any advice, I've been watching some videos or has a hookup with resin, <laughs> not really, I'm just kidding about that. Um, just, just shoot me a shoot me a message, you know, for the group, and, and so we can see what the best solution is. Because it's it's I, I get it, it's gorgeous and it's beautiful, but it's expensive for me. So anyhow, well, guys, I wish you all the colors. Uh, you guys have a wonderful day. Bye. Fiesta. You celebrating day number what seventy three? Fiesta. Fiesta hat dance. Fiesta hat dance. Fiesta hat dance.